What up, Tanya Daka of TanyaDaka.com? Coming to you with a little fucking. I'm gonna. I gotta turn around because I tried to record. There you go. I wanted you to see the fucking ocean. And this is home. Welcome to my home. I wanted to um, bring you a little fucking bad news today. Uh, you're not Gary V. You're not Chris Brogan. You're not Nike. You're not, I don't know who the fuck ever is out there. Knob Creek. You are somebody who has a message, but you're scared of it. And you don't want to show up because it means, hey, I might fucking make a mistake. I might fail. They might recognize that I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing. You don't have to know what the fuck you're doing. You have to know that you've got something in here that needs to be said. You've got something in here or in here that needs to be put out there. You aren't going to own the Jets. Gary V is going to own the Jets. But that's because Gary V has been at this fucking game for, I don't know, decades while we've been trying to figure it out. He didn't try and figure it out. He just got out and fucking did it. I'm, the, the whole thing is... I'm saying to you, stop fucking being scared. Stop fucking thinking that somebody else is going to do it better than you. There's always going to be somebody doing it better than you. There's always going to be somebody that has better content or a better cameraman or a better, or a better fucking video editor or whatever. But it doesn't mean that you don't have something that needs to be said. Just because it doesn't look the way everybody else wants it to look. You have to fucking get off your ass and stop being scared of yourself. You're scared of your success. You're scared of, oh, okay, what if, what if I succeed? What if, what if like people actually like what I have to say? It means you're gonna continue to show up. Whoa, I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna show up. I don't wanna do this every fucking day. Then that means you don't want it. And somebody was whining the other day about, you know, I want people to stop saying that, you know, if their mindset is not right, it means that they don't want it bad enough. That's exactly what it means. If you want something fucking bad enough, you will find a fucking way to make it happen, period. You have this tremendous fucking power. You have something that is stitched in your soul that you are supposed to bring to this world. And for whatever reason, you're too scared to let it come out. You're too, don't get me wet. Damn it, I have a hole in my boots. You're too scared to, to let people see you, to let them in, to let them see that, that you know, you're not perfect, that you're not going to do things the way that everybody else does them. I mean, that's what Fire the Diamond is. And I'm watching everybody in there and I'm, I'm going, you know, some people are really, really taking on their fears and like swallowing them and going to do what has to be done because they know that that's what needs to be done. And I'm so fucking proud of everybody in there. But there's just, there's, there's a point where you have to just say, fuck you, fear. Fuck you. Fuck your fucking lies and the and the shit that you're going to say to me or the shit that you do say to me I'm going to do this I'm going to fucking make it happen so but you gotta it's not like you're going to say oh switch is on I'm here this is it I'm showing up no it's, it's a battle it's a battle that we fucking fight every day and what that means is when you wake up in the morning and you feel like shit I got up at three o'clock this morning three o'clock I was like okay I'm gonna get up at three o'clock and I'm gonna get my shit done because today's Friday. I've got meetings this, this morning. I've got appointments. I got shit to do So I'm gonna go three o'clock get up get my stuff done so I can have it free and clear for the morning That's what we have to do. Gary V is proud because he gets up at five. I have to get up at three um, Because my life is not that of a globe-trotting free spirit entrepreneur doing what he wants to do. My life is tied to three children. Your lives are tied to whatever, your husband, your your children, your your house, your values, your whatever. So you're not going to be Gary Vee. I'm not going to be Gary Vee as much as I would love to be Gary Vee. Um, we have to, you, you have to accept that you are who you are and you have to accept that you have a message to give, to bring. Danny and I had a conversation yesterday and it was like this light bulb came on with her and I saw it come on. That was the best fucking thing ever because I've been telling her for all this time, one, two, three, one, two, three, and she kind of, she knew it. It wasn't like it was news to her. She knew it, but 
the the why and the how and the everything clicked for her at that point and you have to get in and you have to have these conversations in order to make that fear just take a step back for for one day and then take a step back for another day and then you got to have another conversation make it take a step back another day it's a fucking battle it's a fucking rite of fucking passage we are not walking out into the woods going and having some fucking peyote and like turning around and everything is okay and and the world is, is falling into place it is a fucking battle that you have to fight every day when you wake up. Three o'clock this morning, I did not want to fucking get up. I did not want to do it. I got up, I did my journaling, I did my money work, I put my goals back in the front of my head and was like, okay, yes, this is where I am today. This is where I am today. Okay, there's nothing that I can do right now. I'm going back to bed. So I fucking went back to bed. You gotta do that sometimes. But the thing is, you gotta have that fucking awareness of yourself, that know thyself shit. You gotta know what you can do, know what you can't do, and work within that. But the what you can't do can be chipped away at. There's there are, there are hard lines where like some people are just never ever going to fucking be able to show up. They're just it's just not in them to show up. It's in them to do the work behind the scenes to be the the ghost in the machine or whatever. But it's not in them to show up and to be a, a leader in their business or whatever. So those are the the hard lines that you have to accept. But the the not so hard lines are the ones that. That the ones that have the little, mm, I can do this, mm, I can do this, mm, I can do this in the background going, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. And then you have to fucking just swallow the fear and make it happen. You're not ever going to be a Gary Vee. I'm never, I'm never going to be a Gary Vee, but what we can be is who the fuck we're supposed to be. You take your truth, you take your message, and you fucking swallow your fear every day, and you swallow the doubt, and you swallow the, 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 the fear of success, and you let it all out onto the table, and you don't fucking worry about it one day at a time it's not gonna happen all at once it's gonna happen one day at a time and when you do you will find that plane where it's all like fuck you I'm not kidding it's like I don't need you I don't need this I don't need that I know what I need I know what I'm doing I know what I want to do and I know what I'm going after there's my path I'm on it okay find your fucking path don't sit don't wonder don't wish don't don't wait don't scroll don't I need to learn one more thing I need to learn I don't know how to do this I don't know how to do this this is the thing you need to have your message and then you need to go find out a way to get it out there that doesn't even fucking involve shit you could have learned on a blog anyway um, that's it we're at fire the diamond um, you can come and check us out we are doing the dirty work every fucking day and we are beating our demons actually I'm not fucking beating my demons I'm standing side by side with my demons and I fucking love it if you want to come with us join us and we will watch as the world stands in awe of the diamonds later gator